Hey, coffee and espresso lovers, Mark and Todd here from the whole out there love. We're live in the studio here, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, well, live. Topics <laughs> lined up. I want to talk about the, our, our bundler. This allows you to package uh, expertly selected products with each other, save some money. Um, these are hand curated, so you're going to end up with things that are, are uh, oh, yeah, let me know we're live, so it always helps if I switch the mic on. Here we go. Sorry about that. So some hand curated products that are going to work well together and save you some money, right, Todd? Yep. And we had Nick Brown, our sales manager. He knows all this stuff really well, and he chose what he wanted to put in the bundle. So uh, he did a good job. Should we really take a quick choices. look at just how that works? Because it is, it is kind of cool. We're going to pull that up. Um, so for instance, there's the uh, Gaja Classic Pro right here, and we'll, we'll brew on that in a moment. It's a, you know, my favorite entry level uh, machine. So you have some options there as far as grinders. Um, so we have a, there's a Sete 270 and 270WI in there, really nice home use grinders um, that you could bundle with that and save some money mm -hmm. purchasing those. And that goes for some of the other products as well. You can choose things um, like we have the Nanotech baskets in there, um, which we really like. I have that on the Classic um, Pro as well. So we'll take a look at that. Uh, even have that the knockbox or a version of it that's in there. So you can take a look at that. But if you bundle up the products, I guess the point is you can save some money. And also, these are products that have been hand selected by our experts to work well. Yeah, and together. then you can also see them in size relation. Yes. So that, that's real, it's, a, it's a real size, so you know what it's going to look like on your counter. So, um, and together. Together. So I have a classic, a couple Baratza grinders. We've got a Eureka uh, Specialita. Yes, mm -hmm. a Eureka Specialita. Got the Proftech Pro 500 uh, PID, heat exchange machine. Yep. Uh, what do you have next to you, Todd? That's uh, ECM uh, grinder V Titan. Titanium yeah. burrs. Yeah. And then the uh, ECM Synchronica and the Shadow E37S, which so, we call the SQ for quick set. <laughs> yes. Yeah. So let's take a look. Let me let's brew on the classic, and we'll take a look at how that works with you know some grinders that we packaged up with it. Um, so I'm going to take my portafilter out. Now, if you're newer to espresso, you always want to have your your portafilter in your machine to keep it nice and warm. Um, now I'm making a bit of a mess here. Coffee is kind of a messy. It business. is a messy business. So I'm going to use the Sete. So we have the 270WI and the Sete 270. So the 270, that's a time-based grinder. The WI is a weight-based grinder. What I really like about the WI here is you have three weight presets. And as I just hit a button here, it's just going to turn on. So I'm going to, what I'm going to do is 17 grams, but I could have another one here at 10. You can make these whatever you want. Or I can do a triple shot here at 21.3. I could adjust that. You know, I want 22 grams for that one. So let's go with that. So I'll just hold the button and it'll save that. But what I'm going to do is 17 grams, and this weighs as the coffee is grinding. So I, I'm requesting 17 grams. It's automatically teared the grinder. And then you luck, we'll get just about 17 grams here. 17.1, and that's what I found with this grinder, is it's usually within a tenth or two of what you requested, and it does learn as you go on. I'm going to use another accessory we have here. I really like this. This is the Jack Leveler. Um, with this, a lot of people will tamp after, but you don't have to. So you can just put that in and spin. And if you wanted to tamp, you can't. In my mind, the coffee is compressed. It's going to be perfectly level every time. It's going to help you a lot uh, to reduce channeling when you get that perfectly level tamp. Um, another accessory, I love these pitchers. These are a, a three-spout uh, shot pitcher. Very, very nice. And I'm just going to press my brew button there. And again, this is the Classic Pro, really nice entry-level machine. And you can also bundle coffees with your purchases. I happen to be using Maroma's Orphea here, one of my favorite coffees. And if I got my grind dialed in nicely, we should get some nice crema on that. Yeah, I'd say the Classic is by far the best value for a semi-automatic machine you can get. Really is. If you know, don't go with a pressurized basket. Uh, machine. I'll stop that there. And that's that Orphea. Um, I could dial it in probably a little bit better, but that's looking pretty darn nice. Yeah, full 58 millimeter chrome plate yeah. of brass portafilter. So that's a full, the Classic Pro is a full on machine. It is a single boiler, so if you're going to go steam on this, there is a weight. But the, on the Classic Pro, it's a, a lot shorter weight. Like I've compared this to a Sylvia, and a Sylvia can be as much as two minutes to get up to steam temperature. 
on the Classic Pro, you could go maybe 45 seconds and it's ready yeah, to do or your Or a little less, yeah. Or even a little less. Yeah, it's got the three-way solenoid valve which releases water so off the puck, so a nice dry puck. You get a relatively dry puck. Big group head, full size, 58 millimeter. And it does come, if you want to start without a grinder, you could use pre-ground coffee. It does come with a pressurized basket mm -hmm. um, if you didn't want to grind yeah, fresh. I'll, I'll take that. <laughs> okay. All right. So let's take a look down. Why don't we go to the other end and Todd talk a little bit about the uh, Synchronica here. Okay. So, you know, we're here kind of about the bundler, so I'll kind of right. talk about the bundler for a minute. Yeah. You know, so the object with that is you want to see what looks good. So over here, the V Titan is a beautiful looking grinder with that. So if you want to match it up, stick that in the bundler, take a look. Because that's an ECM grinder. ECM grinder, right? yep. With the, mm -hmm. uh, yep, so it matches nice. Yep, we like that one. That's a really good heavy duty grinder. Work, works very well. Uh, ECM Synchronic, as you see, is a beautiful machine. This is one of our best sellers without question. Uh, this one happens to have the flow control device on it, which is an add on that we put on. And we, I know we have videos on it. You go check those out, see what that's yep. all about. And then the steam valves on this, uh, the sprung valves, and lots of steam pressure. Uh, you can get up to almost two bars of steam pressure on this. Actually, it'll go up there in a few minutes, in a minute here. I just blew it out. There you see, is it heating back up? This is the best steam pressure of any of the home machines. You find this on the, well, on the ECM Synchronica, the Profitec Pro 600, Profitec Pro 700. Another yeah. two more dual boiler machines. Exactly. The, the Pro 700, this is, so internally the Synchronica and the Pro 700 are very, very similar. Mm -hmm. uh, just the Synchronica just kind of takes the dressing to the next level. Yeah. And it's got that unique one-piece frame. You yep. can get inside this black. machine, inside of, uh, it's just six screws out the top and boom. Yeah. Take For the anybody who's right watched up. my videos, I'm all about what's easy to service. And yeah. there's nothing better. So if anything ever does go wrong, we can help you out. We, you, if four screws, the whole fights come off and we can fix it. I know we're not here to talk about fixing machines, but right. I am a tech guy, so it kind of seems to always go that way. <laughs> That's one of the reasons I love this and all ECM Profit Techs. So a grind. So this the the T V Titan grinder with the titanium burrs, mm -hmm. um, 64 millimeter burr grinder, I believe. Uh, but titanium burrs they last basically forever, a lifetime of home use. You'd mm -hmm. never change the burrs in this. Yep. Um, the titanium's also a little more slippery than standard stainless burrs. Okay. Um, or so I've been told. Mm -hmm. uh, but then over here you've got one of our favorite grinders. I know a lot of cafes use this grinder. Yeah, this is the Chiaro E37S, and uh, it's got uh, th three time shots, single, double, then it has what they call the extra one here. So like this single shot, 3.4 seconds, that's more than normal. I, have a, I had that set up for my Delacorte grinder, 3.8, had that set up for my Profitech, mm -hmm. and over here, I had that set up for the Pro 800. So you can set different uh, shot timings for each one, and it's got the adjustment here, Really nice adjustment. You go as little or as much as you want. And then uh, say you get your, your special dialed in where you want, you can move this and put that in line with that. And then you can make your very minor adjustments and you can remember where you were at. Uh, very quiet, commercial grade. Sell a lot of these for home, but they can handle a cafe. And uh, Tony from Fuego will be coming here later to show you how, this, how to dial this. And he uses this in his cafes. Absolutely yeah. loves it. We're doing the live streams all day long, top every hour. So that's mm -hmm. later this afternoon. But why not, can we hear that? Do some grinding? Sure. Maybe, uh, I don't know if you're dialed in, but can we pull a shot on the Synchronica and maybe Ooh, give it a shot? And we will. If you have any questions about these products um, or, or anything yeah. coffee or espresso, we are taking questions yeah. during the no live clumping. stream. Beautiful. Oh, that's, that is nice. You got a tamper? I, I have a leveler. Have a leveler. leveler. He's a leveler guy. <laughs> it, whoops, whoops. In case you didn't notice. I love that. I love it. Those levelers, they really help with the channeling because you get a really okay. nice I'm going to start, since I have a flow control, a two gram pre-infusion on this. We'll give that for around 10 seconds. And that's Put nice a with the Synchronica. You've got the, the shot okay. clock here. So I'll get, get up the full pressure for a little flow. Now, if your shots look better than mine. <laughs> Well, I haven't tested at this flow rate, so I'm just doing it for demonstration purposes only. But it's nice with the, with the flow control on this, you also get that group pressure gauge, mm -hmm. which is nice. Those are, yeah. your shots are looking yeah. pretty nice. Yeah. And I'll get down to real low flow here to finish. Then we'll shut her off. 
So that's how the E37S and a little bit about the Synchronica. So over here, let's take a look. I've got a Eureka Pignon Specialita grinder. Um, I really like these for the ease of use. So you've got a single and double timed preset on these. But as far as you know, changing the timing, these are some of the easiest to do. You just use the plus and minus button. There's no other buttons to press. It'll keep that now. Uh, but I do want you to hear this because this is a nice quiet grinder as well. Let me just clean this portafilter out so it doesn't look terrible. And if you can hear that, it's got a real nice sound. I mean, nowhere near as fast as, say, the uh, 270. But it does do a really nice, really, really nice grind. Um, and really, uh, uh, it's a very silent grinder as well compared to, say, something like the 270. So if the 270 is going to be a little too loud for you, maybe something like like this. Grind size adjustment is this micrometer adjustment knob here. And Eureka grinders, most of them, they adjust. They don't move the top burr up and down like a lot of grinders do. They move from the bottom. So they, they move up from the bottom, um, which means when you open these up, uh, you don't lose your grind size adjustment either. That's that's true of the E37S over there as well. Mm -hmm. You can get in there real easy. Yeah, I've always had a really easy time with dialing these grinders in. Uh, they're very very easy to do and it feels good too. So and it's a beautiful grinder. So that matches up well with like the Pro 500 here. That'll look great on your counter. Hope we have that one in the bundler with the Pro 500. If not, I'll talk to Nick. Yeah, <laughs> See, okay. Nick, put get it in that, there. Get that in there. Yeah, because it looks sweet. Got the square, it's kind of squared off like the machine and the steam valves. Mm -hmm. So that's a beautiful combination. So, can I put you on the spot a little bit and can we do some frothing on the classic and the synchronica? Sure. Awesome. Yeah. Because well, I just want to show you your... a little bit different. So, I'm going to, I'll turn up the, uh, I'll turn on the, because it's the classic. Are we going to do a lot, Tarrant, or are we just going to do frothing? Well, why don't you, you brew a shot and I'll get this guy going here. Okay. So, okay. the classic happens, it is a single boiler machine. So, I am going to turn it up so to get the okay. steam going here. So I just press the, the steam button here and it's about 45 seconds ish until it'll be ready to steam. You can go a little bit sooner than that if you need to. So we'll brew here and steam there. So Is that Todd's going to brew a shot. He's looking for his favorite cup. Yeah, find for a porn cup. latte art. Yeah, we got a rocket cup. That'll be nice. <laughs> You're mixing brands, Todd. I don't yeah, know. Yeah, I know. That's okay. So now with the flow control, you can operate the machine as though it's not there just by totally opening it. Mm -hmm. Love live stuff. I, I'll tell you what, I'll, you, if you want to, you stop your shot yeah. when you want to. I'll stop it there. It's a little quick, but that's okay. So in the classic here is ready to go. Yeah. Purge it out a little bit. I always purge your wand before you froth, and I've got I've got a towel here for you, Todd. Look at that roll on that. See that? But that's yeah. If we can get the camera in there, very impressed with that. Out of that, you will not get that on the entry level appliance grade type machine. So if you're getting okay. into espresso, and we get it to about 140 degrees, and you just do that by feel, right? Yep. But if you want to put a thermometer in there, we have those. There's your towel, sir. Always okay. purge after you. It's nice off. and creamy. So if the latte air doesn't come out good, we're not going to blame the machine. <laughs> Again, we are taking your questions. So if you have any questions about these products or anything else, you can ask cool. them here. We'll answer live, gotcha. or we will, of course, monitor the comments and answer there as well. Okay. Hey, not bad, Todd. So that's what a classic can do. You know, for the longest time, it had a Penarello wand on it. Now it's got this commercial wand, the, uh, the Classic Pro. It makes all the difference in the world. You see, it's pretty easy to do, too. Really nice steam pressure on it. Very nice. Very nice. And I just like that, you know, of the single boiler machine grade products, it heats up to steaming temperature mm -hmm. faster than just about anything else. I've tested yep. it uh, against a few. Um, you know, and it is, it does have a smaller boiler than some of the other ones, yeah. but it's perfect for, you know, for making well, these drinks like yeah, this. It's a different type of boiler. It's a yeah. high wattage heating elements mounted on the outside of the boiler. Um, so it heats the whole block of the boiler instead of just uh, like a heating element inside. It heats that way. And that way we never have problems with the boilers. Yeah. Uh, the heating elements don't go bad on these. Very nice. Yeah. Um, so what else? So, okay. So the Specialita, the Classic Pro. Um, and the Synchronica. So 
the valves on it. Do we talk about the valves on these? Because they are nice valves. Yeah, the full commercial valves, what we call sprung valves, where you can't crank them down so tight that you ruin the seals. Because when you pull them back, whoops, careful about that. <laughs> when you open it, it pulls back on the seal. So this is a spring that holds the valve seal up against the uh, uh, valve seat. Mm -hmm. So both in this and this. Very, very reliable design. Yeah. Um, and not, not all prosumer machines have that. All right. So let's take a look. At, you know, we are doing these all day. So let's take a quick look at what's coming up a little later or, you know, after the fact, you know, down the road after mm -hmm. today, you can always watch these videos. Um, so coming up at one, we're going to take a look at some of our favorite accessories. We'll do some pour over at two. Uh, we got uh, Tony coming in from Fuego, right? He's mm -hmm. going to dial in. He's going to use an E37S. Yeah, show sure what that's all about. He uses that in you know, in a pro sense, in his coffee shop, right? Mm -hmm. Really likes that. Really good what roaster. was he using before the channel? Yeah, Mel Melconic. I'm not no. sure which one, but Melconic. Okay. Uh, we'll have a barista in uh, that frosts, like, continuously. Now, you're pretty darn good, but yes. the people who do it for a living, they're yeah. really, really it would good. definitely take me to school. And we'll do some cupping later, and then uh, we're going to finish off with a racy, set up a super and a semi-automatic, right, straight fresh out of the box, and yep. see who brews a, an espresso first. Mm -hmm. That sound like a yeah. plan? All they right. They won't be pre-tested. They'll be right out of the box. So, so anything could yeah. go wrong. <laughs> Hope, hopefully, hopefully not. I <laughs> uh, just do want to talk a little bit about, um, again, if you have questions, feel free. But do want to talk a little bit about what we can offer you here at Whole Latte Love. Let's take a real quick look at that. Um, you know, we do have the experts. So uh, any products you're going to find in the bundler, they're hand-selected to work with each other. Of course, you can save some money doing that. As always, we have the free shipping on purchases over 50 bucks. We've been doing this for 20 years. We got the latte reward, so you get basically 2% back when you purchase something. Use that for coffee, accessories. Uh, extended warranties up to three years on some machines for parts and labor. I think something like the Synchronica, that has that, yeah, right? Yeah. Um, and that expert customer service. We have people who will talk to you on the phone. You don't get that very often. They're right here in the building with us. They have access to all these seven, machines. Seven days a week. I don't think anyone's, nobody does what we do. Nobody does. You can call them at 585-924-7170. Get some free advice. They have access to the machines. Can take a look at them, measure things, answer any questions you have. And we're very proud of our 4.9 out of 5 uh, uh, reviews on the website from Trustpilot. So uh, very proud of that. Um, anything else you want to say about uh, the, the products, Todd? No, I feel good. We covered it. <laughs> all right. All right, well, listen, we'll be back shortly, and we're going to take a look at accessories, right? That's mm -hmm. what's coming up next. So yeah. we're going to reset. Uh, if you do have any questions, use those comments and ask, and I or somebody else will answer them personally for you. We'll get you the answers you need. So I'm Mark and Todd. Todd. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys, and we'll see you back here soon for more of the best on everything coffee, brought to you by Whole Latte Love.